Hi, it's uh, Sunday and it's the day before I start working. It's actually it's been quite a few days since I've been working on the boat because um, we did go do some electrical work on the electrical system last week. I also went there um, twice last week to see what has to be ordered um, as uh, deck hardware. So that arrives tomorrow and today I can go and remove some of the old deck hardware that I don't need anymore. Fill those with epoxy. My sister is gonna come along and oil the teak, like the, the teak list that's around the edges of the deck. What else? There was something else that we're gonna do today as well. Oh yes, I'm gonna try to clean the filthy storage uh, box in the cockpit. Hello everybody, I'm Kalle, Sara's brother, and today I'm here at the harbor helping out with some filming for her channel. So. Let's go check the boat out. Today here it's quite windy at the boat. Other sister Rosanna here is making some some oiling stuff. Hello. And uh, Sarah is making some some cleaning of that hatchet over there. Now here she comes with the watering hose. Hello, I'm here in the marina and uh, I haven't filmed the last couple of days but I think we've done a lot of progress and uh, I'm currently preparing the mast to, to, to be put on the boat. We've replaced uh, all the halyards um, and uh, running backstays and the aft stay to Dyneema and the aft stay is a uh, stripped Dyneema and uh, today I'm gonna install the running backstays. I have to get a bolt that goes through the mast because I lost the one that I had from before. And uh, yeah, here's the new uh, Gibb uh, slash Genoa halyard and a Spinnaker halyard. Mm. And uh, yeah, of course, the main halyard over there. Yeah, the next step is uh, installing the running backstays, then changing all the like security rings. I don't know what they're called, but these ones. I got new ones today. And, uh, and then the next step is cleaning the mast, and it's going up tomorrow evening. So there's actually a little bit of a story uh, behind these bolts. Um, the store I went to didn't have the perfect length, so I knew the shorter one would definitely have been too short. So I ended up getting the longer one, but when I was uh, trying it out, I realized that it would hit the top shroud. Um, so I ended up having to actually saw it a little bit shorter, um, and then it fit perfectly. The only issue is that the bolt is not stainless steel, so I'm probably gonna end up having to replace it at some point, but at least for this season uh, it should work just fine. This is the state inside of the boat. It's actually a little bit of a disaster right now, but mm, I have now a functioning electric system. 
Uh, you can see the solar uh, panel is charging the battery. Only thing I have to do now is uh, attach these cables to the roof. I have like this little plastic sheet cover for that. And um, then I also have to attach the solar panel cable somehow. But I think I want to make a, I don't know how to say it, but like a, a deck fitting or something that goes through the deck. Then the cable also will have to run a shorter path to get to the solar charger. And uh, one thing I also have to do is put up the name and the register number of the boat. I'm trying to do that today. And like I said, the mast is going up tomorrow. And then on Tuesday, I want to have a little get together on the boat with like some coffee and cake uh, to thank everyone who's been helping me with the boat. I know it's fuck, but that makes it pretty. So I swapped out, sold up for whiskey. I used to run out barefoot and giddy. Now I'm laced up, it's so restricting. With my heart out, like I'm again.